No, no, not you. No. You stay out of the water. Stay out of the water. Bad B. No, no! All right, how's it going, guys? I'm the Kiwi Gamer, and welcome back to All the Mod 6. We're in the last episode, as you guys can kind of see around here. We actually started ourselves a beekeeping farm, and oh my god, the freaking bees are so freaking cute. I love them so much. Look at this little guy just spitting here. Isn't he freaking adorable? I mean, seriously, this guy is just so freaking cute. Either way, yeah, we kind of did a lot of stuff with the bees. Uh, I made a bunch of beehives, and even before we started today, actually, I went ahead and made ourselves some tier 3 beehives, so that way we could store a lot more bees and also try and get a lot more honeycombs. Now, for today's episode, though, I would like to actually keep going on with the bees, and I want to try and see if we can get ourselves that apiary set up, because I want to try and get breeding the bees a lot more. I want to try, uh, well, I guess getting a lot more bees, too. We got to do that today, too. Uh, I want to see how we can actually even get ourselves, like, the different kind of bees, because I know you can get, like, the material-type bees, but I literally have actually no idea how to do that. So, you know what? We're going to try and work on that today. Now, before we get started with today's episode, though, I do have today's comment pulled up, which I will actually be continuing. Uh, you guys have actually seemed to want it, so I'm going to keep on doing it. I Again, I enjoy doing it. I just need to do it. So, yeah, either way, I do have today's comment pulled up, and thank you very much, Sujan Rajmi. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name, but they said, Kiwi, why don't you put a grass block on the dirt so it can be green, not the ugly dirt? And you know what? That is actually a great question, and I kind of want to do that. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I've kept it this really ugly dirt color this entire time. I think it needs to look a lot nicer, so you know what? Let's see if we can actually get ourselves a grass block. Do I even have one? No, I do not. So we actually do need a silk touch pickaxe, which thankfully I have. And let us go get some, I guess, some grass blocks, and let's actually change this place into a nice, nice scenery. One minute, 37 seconds later. Okay, so I think this actually should be good enough here. It looks like it's actually already spreading rather nice. I don't know if there's a way to do this a lot quicker, so... I don't know. Either way, this is going to take a while for it to spread, but you know what? We got the seeds planted. It's good, and now we'll have a nice, lush, green dirt area instead of a, just a kind of poop brown looking place. So, yeah. Thank you for reminding me to do that because I've actually been kind of wanting to do that for quite a while. Okay, so to kind of get started with today, though, I did manage to get ourselves four tier four beehives, which is actually what we need to go ahead and get started with the apiary. Now, I'm going to be honest, this thing is actually really stupid freaking expensive to do. It takes a lot to actually try and get going. So uh, this is actually going to take a while. So I guess let's go ahead and try and build this. Yeah, I do have everything that I need, thankfully. Wow, that's actually a first. So, yeah, give me that. And then to upgrade this, I need... Oh, you need four AP... Oh, my God. Holy crap. Well, that's okay. That is so many freaking apiaries. Oh, come on. Make a beehive a bee... Or a, make a beehive a home. Nice. Okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. So, we got that going, but that does mean we need also a lot more blocks. I don't know what I want to make it out of, to be entirely honest. Like, we can make it out of basically anything. Although, I probably should go ahead and get the thing out real quick because I don't remember how to actually make it. Uh, That's not the thing. Is it this one? Yeah, okay, okay. So, yeah, it gives us the visualized things. So, I'm going to do that. We're going to place you right there. And then I could use any type of block for this. And then I could put an apiary breeder. And... Oh, wait, no. That's the apiary. And this is the apiary breeder? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know what blocks I should use, though. Maybe glass so I could actually, like, see the inside of the thing? Ooh, yeah. We could do that, actually. I think I should have enough glass. At least I hope so. Uh, only 86. Uh, that might be enough. That might be enough. I hope so. Is it a valid apiary block? Yes. Okay. Good thing it actually says that because it literally says that everywhere on every freaking block. Okay. Oh, you know what? Actually, hold on. Ooh. 
No, instead of glass. Okay, I have a better idea. I have a better idea. I need a bunch of sand. I want to make the Tinker's Construct stuff. The clear glass. Except, I don't know. if Do I already have any of that? No. Crap. Okay, so I do need a lot of sand. Which, of course, I don't have. I can't turn that back into sand. Crap. All right, well, give me a sec. I'm going to go try and make a bunch of clear Tinker's Glass, and that's what we're going to use. It's going to look really cool. Right, let's see if we have enough glass to actually do this thing now. So, one, two, three, four, five. It's a seven by seven by five structure, so that's it's going to be a lot of glass. That is that is for sure. Boom. Four, five. Uh, crap. Crap. Okay, good. We can actually still mine this stuff. Okay, good. That's the thing I like about clear glass. It makes it so much easier to actually mine the thing. Thank you. Oh, wait. What am I doing? I could just use the builder's wand for this. I'm so stupid. I completely forgot this thing exists. <laughs> Crap. Hold on. Uh, wait, did I not place any here? No, of course I didn't. Okay. Now do the builder's wand. Hold on. Uh, that. Boom. <gasps> oh, it makes life so much easier. Oh, I love it. Oh, it is so good. Okay, okay. Is that everything? Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. Yes. Now, am I going to have enough for this? Uh, possibly. Ah, just enough. Thank you. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Man, that does look like a clear dome, does it not? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So, apiary breeder, that goes... Oh, I accidentally filled these in. I did not mean to do that. Okay, so apiary breeder and the apiary. Right? Yes? Wait, what? What? But I did it like it said, right? Yeah, no, it's it's right, right? Okay, well, now I'm just confused. Did I do something wrong? I think I may have. What? Oh. Be import. Oh! Okay, so, the, yeah, the breeder. Okay, okay, okay. So, how do I even put bees in here? Enable preview. What? Okay. How do I put bees in? I can't access that. I really just do not know. Okay. Maybe I could throw my dirt bees in here. Maybe. Let me do that. No. I'm so confused. What does it mean? Do I just have to maybe put the bees inside? Let me try. So break that. Oh, wait, no, I'm missing something. Wait, yeah, no, no, no. It says I'm missing something. I just realized. What? Okay, let's put you guys in there. And then... What am I missing? Why does this have to be so freaking confusing? <laughs> oh, come on, man. Ugh. Oh. Okay, wait a second. Okay, well, the bees are going out. Hold on. I think I might have seen what I messed up. Hold on. So, it said the apiary was supposed to be inside. Or, it's facing inside. So, did I do it right? Can I get out of the stupid thing? The bees are in the way. No? Well, then, what the heck? I'm so confused. I think I'm doing this right. Am I? I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. No, yeah, it's the breeder, or it's the apiary itself that isn't being considered a block in this. What the heck? Why not? Maybe that way? No. Um. There 
There we go. Okay, fine. I don't know why I did that, but that's fine, I guess. All right. So, can I get out of here, please? Thank you. Thank you. And boom. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so how do I put a B in here? <gasps> Ooh. Okay, so B box, B box. Uh, where are my other dirt bees? You. Where? Up. Oh. Here we go. So can I get can I do this through the B box? No, I guess not. Do I actually have to make the freaking jars? I think I do. Yeah, empty B jar. Ah, fine, whatever. You put bees in this, is that really the case? Okay, okay. <laughs> Alright, so dirt B. So we throw you in there, import. And it worked? I I guess. <laughs> what? Wait, how are you even supposed to activate the hive or the storage thing? That makes no sense. Can I... Maybe I should replace this with like um, a glass half slab? Possibly? That may not be a bad idea. What in the world are you doing? <laughs> okay, let me get the rest of the dirty bees out of here. So let's see what we can do. So get you in there, import. What? What? Import. What? I'm so confused. Wait, what? Am I doing this right? I don't think so. B port was unsuccessful. Okay, what does that mean, though? Do I have to, like, let that counter go down and then I can do the thing, maybe? So, okay, that's done. And now he's in the hive. Right? I'm so confused. Wait, are the bees automatically going into the apiary? That could be a thing. I guess. Oh, okay, okay, wait a second. Okay, so I have to unlock the bees for the thing to be able to fill up with honey. Right? Because they're doing their thing. Right? I, I I don't know. It's not doing it. It's really kind of bugging me. <laughs> I don't know. Can I maybe just throw bees in there just normally? Can I maybe do that? So, where's another bee? I think there's one still in here. Yeah. Come on. Do your thing. Okay, so you're fine. And then it just immediately goes back in. What the heck? I'm so confused. <laughs> what? Come on, man. I'm so confused. Oh, this is how I check the storage. Okay, okay, okay. So at least I figured that out. Ugh. Why is this so weird? No, no, stay in the hive, you freaking butt. Hold on. Stay in the hive. I'm missing another dirty bee, too. Ah. All right, so. Stay there. No, stay in the freaking hive, you stupids. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. It. Stop. 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 In the hive. Nope, you guys can't go. Nope, 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 nope. Come on. <laughs> oh, come on. Why do these guys have to be like this? Okay. Let me see if I can try and time this perfectly. So, boom. Yes. <laughs> Finally, caught the bees. All right. So, they're good.
Welp. Okay. I really don't know what to do. To be entirely honest. I... Mm. So it says I need nine... It's nine unique bees that I can have in here at once. But it looks as if the apiary can only hold one bee at a time. So if a bee goes in there, you can't put another bee in. Okay, so how do I import this one, though? I just want to import this bee! Can I do that, please? Here, I'm just going to... Break that real quick. Release you. No, 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 they're all coming out. No, 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 get back in the frickin' thing. Why do you guys do this? What the heck? Okay. So, that. He's still in there. He's still just kind of sitting there. Oh, this is so weird. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. How's the storage doing on this? 32 already. Holy crap. Okay. So are you done? Okay. Boom. You're free. So. Okay. <laughs> I'm so confused. Give me that back. Okay. Now there are five dirt bees in here. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. I hope. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. So if it's unlocked, the bee can leave the hive. Okay, okay, okay. So, well, crap. So do you really only need one bee to make a thing? Is that how it goes? That's a possibility. But it says you can have as many bees on the apiary as you want. So, I guess we're good. So it'll always be making the thing? At least I hope so. So yeah. So let me go ahead and do this real quick without letting any bees escape, preferably. So you go back there. I'm gonna put one flower there. Still good. Still good. And you know, I'm gonna do the C easy way and just get out this way. I'm I want to collect an RGB and I want to put it in there. So that means, oh, wait, no, there's one. Okay, you, in here. So now I should be able to just do that. I can, okay, okay. So now he's good to do whatever, I guess. Can you not, dude? Thank you, okay. So yeah, let's let your ticks run down. And then, actually, let's just go ahead and unlock you. And then I think you should do your thing just anywhere. Right? Okay. He's going on the thing. He's doing it. He's doing it. I think he's doing it. And then he can just go into the thing? I guess? Well, then, what in the world is this, then? <laughs> Wait, so if I want to breed, so I don't even need all the bees in here to be doing this. Okay, okay. Go go into the apiary. Go into the apiary. Go into the thing. Please. Okay, or not. Maybe I shouldn't have all these bees in here. Yeah, maybe not, maybe not. Well, let's go ahead and store up the rest of the dirty bees, because I think they're kind of getting in the way of the apiary, and that's why this guy is not able to go into it, right? Yeah, because he's pollinated. Yep, there he goes. Okay, okay. I think I'm understanding this. I actually think I'm understanding this. At least I really hope so. So, give me this back. Boom. And we're good, right? Yeah, I think we're good. Cool, cool, cool. So, the other bees, I guess I could just, uh, let go. Yeah, you guys do your thing over here. Cool. But I want to try this out real quick. So, the breeder, so... Okay, crap. I need to be daytime and not raining, so the freaking bees will come out. 
This one have the bees. Can you guys come out of here real quick? Oh crap, I put the smoker up. Ah, eh, whatever. Okay. So one, two, that's all I need. B type dirty. Okay, so the breeder. So I just throw two bees in there and then I put the flowers in here. And then I put one extra jar in there. And do they breed? Do they do the do? <gasps> they do! Okay, okay. So that is actually working. It's just a lot slower than actually like doing the normal breeding way. <laughs> okay, okay. That's still not too bad, not too bad. Here, what is our little beeper? What do you use? Or what do you use to pollinate? A block of gunpowder. Really? Well, okay, then. If that's what he's asking for, I guess I have no choice. Okay. So, gunpowder, please give me that. I'm assuming it's just this. Yep. Now, we only need one block of it for it to actually do the pollination stuff, so that should be fine. Give me that back. So, yeah. And then right here. There we go. Place that. Crap. No, no, not you. No. You stay out of the water. Stay out of the water. Bad B. No, no! Why? Why? I have to time this perfectly. Yes! Okay, I did it. Oh, wait. Oh, dang it. I did it wrong already. Okay. There we freaking go. Dang it! Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay. Put that back. And where did my beeper go? There he is. Hey, you. Come here. Let's put you into our hive. Boom. And we'll go ahead and unlock you so you can actually produce this stuff. Uh, let me see. What else? What else? What else? Oh, we got to get our freaking dirt bee back because this stupid one died. Can you guys come out of here, please? Thank you. Give me you. I can throw you back in here. Unlock you. Okay. I would, however, like to go ahead and try and get the storage upgrades, though, because we're going to need a lot more than that. So... Uh, yeah, storage upgrades. So I just need iron, another apiary storage, a freaking course. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. Uh, give me these because I'm probably going to need them. Okay, give me that. Thank you. And now we need the iron upgrade, which I can do. And now gold. Yeah. Diamond. Yeah, we're still good. Emerald? Still good? Breeder upgrade. Uh, not quite what we need. But is that it? I think that is... Okay, okay, cool. So, crap, where'd it go? <laughs> I already lost it. Okay, there we go. Emerald storage upgrade. Nice. Maximum comb storage. Nice, nice. I guess we could also try the breeder upgrades, too. So, yeah, <laughs> we got another dirt bee. Nice. Holy crap, that was a lot more than I thought. Okay. No, that's pretty good. Cool. Cool. I'm cool with that. I guess let's also go ahead and try the breeder upgrade because uh, why not? So I need gold storage upgrade, a freaking course. So I need yet another one of these. I need more freaking comb or honeycomb blocks. Crap. One week later. Okay, give me that. Then give me the gold. I'll always take the gold and then breeder upgrade. Oh, I need more jars. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, give me some more of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You know what? Just give me a lot of them. And then, boom. Breeder upgrade. Thank you. Now, breeder time upgrade. Of course, I need another freaking storage thing. 
Oh, you know what? We're fine. Should have all the items to do it. At least I freaking hope so. Be that. Be this. And then breeder time upgrade. Boom. Thank you. Okay, cool. Faster breeding, more breeding. Very, very creative uh, achievement names, I guess. Cool. So, breeder upgrade. Oh, okay, so I can actually do more bees. Okay, okay, cool, cool. Oh, that's nice. How are you guys going on the storage, by the way? Still pretty good. Still pretty freaking good. Cool. So I guess in the meantime, I want to figure out how to get more bees, which is still kind of confusing to me. Like, I want to be able to get the the coal bees, the crimson iron bees, you know, all the things, basically. Actually, the emerald bees I would really like to get. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. So, a gold bee you get from quartz and stone bee, of course. Uh, you get from cobby and lava bee. Oh, my God. Cobby. Okay, how do you get a cobby, though? And then what the heck? <laughs> I haven't found a cobby yet. Or a kobe. Whatever you call it. Uh, crap. Okay, so what if I just want, like, a normal iron bee? What do I need for that? So, iron bee... Yeah, quartz and stone. Okay. Huh. So, how do I find them, though? How do I find a cobby? I actually have no idea. Unless you can find them underground? Or, like, in a really stony place? I don't know for sure. I guess I can try and search out for them, see what I can actually find. And that's a filled nest. Oh, with RGB stuff. Okay, we don't need that. <laughs> Yeah, I guess I'll go out and I'll try and find some bees. Maybe in, like, a gravelly area. Oh, you know what? Actually, yeah, the nature's compass might be good for this thing. So I'm going to check that out and see what we could find. <gasps> oh! Oh, you're a copy! <gasps> yes! Okay, wow, that actually worked. I didn't think we would actually find any. Okay, you get in my box. Uh, This one also get in my box. Uh, Is there any more? Ow. See another little white dot. <gasps> what are you? Oh, you're a Stamby. Okay, we'll take you. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I really did not expect that to work. <laughs> okay. So, I have the Cobby. So, now I need a Stone Bee. And to get the Stone Bee, I need a Lala Bee. And... Does that mean they spawn in the Nether? Possibly? Whoa. Okay, so probably the nether is what I'm thinking, because it doesn't tell me what uh, what spots or like what areas. It just says, oh, uh, man, I am so stupid. It actually does tell me. All right, so yeah, the nether. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So I know where we're going next. Oh, you know what? Oh, I'm so stupid. Yeah, this thing would probably help out like crazy. Right? Can I even see bees? There was just a bee around here somewhere. No, yeah, yeah, They show up as green. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, that'll help out quite a bit. Okay, I think I'm good on bees for now. So let's go ahead and head on back if I can. Okay, crap. Uh, Crap, 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 crap. Give me that. Okay. Now let's get out of here. So, hopefully the bees won't, like, attack each other. I'm pretty sure that's not a thing. Oh, look at that. A plague doctor's over here. How are you doing? Hi. And, of course, you have nothing that I want. All right, cool. Okay, so... Bee box. Oh, my God. <laughs> there are so many freaking bees. Wait! Eh? I didn't know they would do that. They really just all went in here? Wait, so, hold on. Stone bee, stone bee. I need stone bee. No, I'm not seeing a stone bee. Okay, crap. So, I actually have to export one. 
Uh, the glowing bee. What? Oh, crap, 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 crap. Okay, they're all leaving. Okay. Wait, what? Where's my lava bee? I had one, right? Yeah, no, he's in there. Okay, so empty jar. You. Well, we already have a stone bee in there, don't we? No, we don't. No, we don't. Okay, so... You... Go in there. You... Go in there. Thank you. Okay. So let's unlock that. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is so stupid. <laughs> all right. All right. So here's the thing. How am I going to do the lava bee? That's what I don't know. I don't, I don't want them to die. So <laughs> I could maybe do something similar to what I had there because I noticed the water bee likes to pick stuff up through the grass so maybe maybe it might do that i don't know maybe all right well you know what i actually do think i'm gonna go ahead and end it here for today's episode so i think i'm getting the hang of the bees um we have all sorts of different bees now in our little apiary thing here i am in love with all of them they are so freaking cute and i want to collect as many more as i possibly can so that's going to be a lot of fun I'm going to try and see what else I can do in the meantime. I'm going to try, I guess I'm going to try and get the appropriate flowers and stuff into the apiary. So that way we could actually, you know, get the honeycombs and stuff that we're going to need for a lot of the stuff. So yeah. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit that like button. Also subscribe to the channel so that way you guys can catch up on the rest of the series. Also, there's a link to my Discord in the description below if you guys want to check that out. It's a place where you guys can all talk amongst yourselves and give me some new ideas for videos. So, it's pretty freaking cool. So, other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. And you all are awesome.